going forward, Hitachi will invest 100 billion yen in the field, such as the mining, agriculture, healthcare, railway, and security in Australia. Hitachi will contribute to resolving Australian society's social issues and to improving quality of life for everyone. I hope it is a summit uh, that delivers some tangible outcomes, more interest, more partnerships, more collaboration, uh, because there's no doubt in some of the ideas that have been considered, we've got a chance uh, to truly shape and tackle some of the biggest social problems we have. We really don't know what the future holds, uh, but what we are clear is there are many more opportunities to do far more than we could have ever imagined. It's not just enough for one company to introduce new products and services. Social innovation needs to occur in collaboration with a broader range of stakeholders, including non-for-profit organisations, consumers and government. But I think importantly Australia is leading the way in the application of Internet of Things applications into the industrial sphere. We're living in an incredibly exciting world. Even though we have all these challenges, the possibility for change is tremendous. But what our focus is, is really on the data. It's not so much about the connectivity. Unless you're capturing that data, you can't get insight. Innovation is the lifeblood of our society today, and it actually always has been. When we look at healthcare, I think one of the key points we look at is really innovation. It's an area of high unmet need. We've got multiple diseases that we still don't have solutions for. And more and more we see innovations that are coming in not just from healthcare companies, but from technology-based companies. In the railways, there's a lot of potential for the utilisation of IT and the connection of not just our products and services but the whole end-to-end -end offering in a fully optimised railway system, be that energy, be that the customer experience or uh, be that optimising the revenue of our operators themselves. But it's about data, it's about collaboration and it's about multiple use. We're here today to see this, if there's a challenge, gee, there's a lot of creativity out there and it might not come from the sector who traditionally deals with it, it might actually come from somewhere else. We have this very interesting panel which starts in the terrorism space, in the high security spaces, and we move into what can make the most sense in terms of a societal. But the first simple question is, how can we make technology accessible to the agricultural community and have them engage in the take up of it? There's some very good sessions to see. And would you come again if this was on yes, next Yes, I would. Yeah. I think it's fantastic. I've been blown away by all the different stands, in particular by the healthcare stand. Lots of new things, lots of things that are reinforcing some of the pathways we're already on. So yeah, it's great. I'm really enjoying it.